Hi guys, my name is Abby. I watch three different families on a weekly basis, so I know it can be a little crazy meeting a family for the first time. Today, we're gonna be going over eight icebreaker activities to do with kids. The first activity is called Book About Me. Grab your crayons, construction paper, and markers. To make the book, you can fold the construction paper in half and easily staple it. Inside, you can write questions like, what do you wanna be when you grow up? Or who is in your family? And help the kids illustrate it inside their book. If the kids are younger and can't necessarily read or write, you can cut out pictures of their friends and families, maybe even their pets, and help them tape it in their book. This is a fun craft and something the parents would love to keep. The next activity is called, What Sounds Do the Animals Make? I like to play this game with kids typically around the age one and four. You can ask them questions like, what sound does a pig make? What sound does a cow make? And I think it's so cute just watching them snort like a pig and moo like a cow. It's a super cute game and this really gets them out of their comfort zone. The next activity is called Either Or. This is a great way to get to know the kids you're watching without overwhelming them. Do you want broccoli or cake? Broccoli. No, cake. Cake. You want cake too? Do you want broccoli cake? No. <laughs> <laughs> For older kids, I like to make it more adaptable to them and more age appropriate. So I ask them questions like, do you like summer or winter? Do you like TikTok or Netflix? Or do you like breakfast or dinner? Up next, we have a tour guide. This is a great way to explore the house while making the kids feel knowledgeable and capable. For little kids, I ask them questions like, where did your backpack go after school? Or show me your room. For older kids, I make it a little bit more adaptable to them and I ask them questions like, how does your Xbox work? Or where's your favorite hangout spot in the house? Next is an easy but surprisingly effective activity, introductions. I like to ask the kids their name, their age, and one thing they like to do. You can also ask follow-up questions like, when's their birthday? Or if they're involved in any sports. Up next, we have show and tell. This is a great way for kids to show off their prized possessions. Okay, on a count of one, two, three, go and find your favorite toy, okay? okay? One, two, three. All they do is go around the house, pick out their favorite items to share with me. And for the older kids, I ask them, what is one item you had since you were little? Wow. For kids that are especially shy, Token for Your Thoughts is a great icebreaker activity that gives them a small reward for engaging with you. All you need is five to 10 tokens like cereal puffs or candy like M&Ms, and then you have a list of questions that you ask them. For every question that they answer, they get a small token as a reward. The last activity is called Beach Ball Bash. All you'll need for this is a beach ball and a permanent marker. Get a list of get to know you questions and write them all over the beach ball. Then go outside, you can either pass the ball in the air or roll it on the ground. When the kid has the beach ball, ask them to answer the question that's closest to their right hand. What do you like to eat for dinner? Pancakes. Pancakes? <laughs> this is a great activity, it's super fun, and my kids love it. Those are all the icebreakers I like to do with my kids. If you end up using any of these or even have your own, drop them down below. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.